where have you gone, my lily of the valley? I, my, 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 psalm, psalter of, of, of the, the, the love and mercy and, and, and unplagiarizable hymnals drifting, riding by the stream of love and joy. And here I, I, I will say that uh, something's going on with the other one. I can't, won't go on. So I'll, I'll write it again. Um, let's say it again. Eight by seven, seven by six. We'll rendezvous where Farmer Paul mixes his tears with the rain. Nobility beats with a heart like that of ancient Spain. There's a man in the weeds where the crescent rose blooms. An angel breeding ladies here by the light of the northernmost mule-saddled moon. So why the doors St. Christopher's forge weave me an amulet of Joan of Arc war? Where all roads home were slipped with ice, and dreams were sold to market at half price. Offer me shelter, love, and prayer. Uh, 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 great by the steeps where mercy despairs the night so that a dark tunnel train overtakes the soul and bows the head in a room of thoughts drawn milk wove of bittersweet coal mine silks and the deaconess came from a land half born she'd long ago all aborted caravans into the cities and towns where within open doors led into dim lit rooms in which statues breathing fire held the moon in their hands reading somnic poems much older than time or space did record and the deaconess gave and took from idealism's brides and grooms and deckless crosses all forged and killed from heaven's warm gates the starry night wrapped her shoulders round with the very same quilt her mother had all aborted and homeward carried from the winding stream it's a winding stream Lazarian proclamated the apologist traveled day and night until he came to the flickering light of the last night of the night's last star how far he asked the slowly fading starlight should I rail, walk, and carriage wheel roll until I find a place where all the people my words have wounded will forgive me? You must find the silver and brass castle they call Quisentensis. It beats its multitudinous heart within and without all who ever lived. The star suddenly brightened her shimmering diamond orb, and two sweethearts sat by the pasture gates and very much in love, kissed one another passionately, doing for each other day and night what only love may accomplish. The land your deep well water, uh, deep well water eyed pasture to seedsman leaned his against his plow, as lovers of every age filled his rolling fields with dance, song, and swooching all day long, and they all said to one another, Where's Lauren, the singing angel with the heart of gold? And where are all the hippies and yippies that will forgive the, ver the versing tin-capped poet for his crueler life's mo his cruelest, his cruelest moments of his life that passed every now and then? And then we'll continue on with the story later. <clears throat> God bless, peace, love, and everything. Let's see how much time it took. I don't know if the, if the other one's on yet, but I'll, I'll put this one. Um, so, uh, four minutes to see if it goes.